All right, 4th of July special edition at the Corky Farm. <clears throat> we found a turtle wandering around our farm named Lily now. Yeah. And we are in love, but we are working on letting her go, even though it's hard. Well, she lives in our farm and our farm is fully fenced. So we'll let her go and then we'll just search for Lily all the time. And we can leave special treats out. As you can see, we left some carrot trails and some berries. Oh, careful, don't flip her over. This is Lily. She's got her head hidden. So I think we need to put her oh, back so she can go. I don't want to. I know it's so hard when you love something, but you gotta let it go. Okay, but I'll put her in the street. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Violet. Let's put her back in the path she's going. I think that if you put her too far away, she won't be able to find her way home. Let's, let's, let's kind of keep her in the same path. Is it path. appropriate if you kiss a turtle? You can kiss her. And wish her love. And say, I hope you find your family and come back and visit this family. Okay? Dad. Sounds good? Dad? Matt Dad. just announced that the poop is out. That means uh, we are currently fertilizing. <laughs> Wish her well. Violet will not let the tortoise the turtle. I know. Just let her down nicely. Set her down so nice. I don't want her getting so I okay, find her the perfect spot. And Bjorn is going to check on Belle, who is down there winning, because I have her locked in to eat her food. But all her friends left. So she's not so happy. And we are putting fertilizer in our new beds, our planting beds, and then organic dirt on top. Kind of stay as green as possible. Oh. Hold on. You're just here. That's probably where her home is. Maybe I, that would be so lucky if so, huh? Probably. You think she's tired from her journey? Yeah. So we have soil and everything in these ones. I have watermelon, ma um, the giant mammoth sunflowers, and peppers. Same thing over here. Sunflowers, peppers, and watermelon, two different kinds. I'm trying to find the hottest peppers because Matt likes peppers and I want to find the hottest ones so I can make him eat them and sweat. So it's really fun for me. I know, it's so mean. But he likes it, so that's good. Um, here are new planters today that we've done. This one just has the fertilizer, so now we're adding topsoil and then watering it, mixing it, and kind of letting it sit. So we'll be getting that done. We put down, um, we put down boxes for the manure since it was so gross and dirty on our new turf. And then that one over there needs to be done. And then we'll be good with flowers, peppers, watermelon, corn, and like so many sunflowers, like so many. Because I love sunflowers so much. Oh my God, I love them. Look at them, hummingbird. I also have a thing for hummingbirds. They make me happy. You can hear Belle in the background. She's very loved up. Okay. Let's go see if the turtle left. So I'm visiting this area with sunflowers, watermelon, peppers. She's so beautiful. Did she leave? Mm -hmm. Did you find her? Yeah. Where'd she go? Did she leave? No, you, not yet. You kind of have a sad face. Are you okay? I want her to see. I, you're having big emotions? Yeah. Me too. I'm sorry. Do you need a hug? I was like, why is that making me run out? And then I was like... Do you need a hug? Here, can I have a hug? I need a hug. Oh. I know, we love the turtles, huh? 
Do you think we're a total loving family? We're gonna work through the with the Wait, museum place. What remember? Is she doing here? Violet, did she bring her over? Baby, Violet. I want her near me. I know, but this is really near. I know. I want her. Okay. Well, we have to talk about this a little I bit. Want her to be my pet. Well, she can't really be our pet. She can live on our farm. However, we're gonna work with the desert museum, remember? And we're gonna adopt the tortoise and build the the whole thing. They're gonna tell us how to build it. Wait, we're gonna work with the desert museum and make them get us one? Yeah, they have an adoption program. And we're gonna adopt a tortoise. Yep, but they teach you how to make the proper... Can I keep her place in my room? Not in your room, it's gonna be in the front courtyard area. But they remember they teach us how to build the perfect habitat. So it's like, it's ones that need an extra home. Obviously this one's her, very, I know, but this one's healthy. The desert no, this one's healthy and she obviously has a good habitat here. So we gotta let her be. I know it's so hard. <clears throat> I feel you, baby.